When I Was a Kid video series. This is number six. I don't have enough fingers right now. There, see it? Woo, there it is. All right, uh, oh, you probably didn't see it. Anyway, <laughs> what's up? So this is video number um, six of When I Was a Kid. I did this. Uh, this is what I did. Now, I was a little bit bigger of a kid, but you can see this box has power input, audio input, power switches, knobs, controls, and antenna. There used to be audio down here and a speaker up here. This is battery powered, but right now I have a cord wired up to it so that I can actually use it because the battery's shot. But this is an old uh, little LCD screen that I had, and I'm actually recording this little camera right there okay it's plugged into a power supply right now but you can run it off batteries and uh... yeah i actually had this attached to this rc car okay and this servo was controlled and this servo was controlled so i could literally look the camera was mounted on top of here i could look down, I could look up, I could look left, I could look right. I had, uh, there used to be a pole switch right here for two lights that I used to have on the front of here. Um, the RC uh, remotes that I've got that I've acquired over the years are hanging up there. And one of them is, uh, is hooked up so that one of the sticks is forward and drive. Um, and then the other stick controls these uh, servos for the camera. So, yeah, this was portable. I could go and bring this out with me, and I would uh, go out. I'd actually drive this in the college dorm. I did. I drove it in the college dorm, and I would drive around and actually sneak in uh, to people's dorms, like, with their door. They just had their doors open. So, all right. So, I just, I literally, I just would drive in there, and uh, because I could hear the audio, because that, um, I bought a different one. This one doesn't have uh, audio. But I did, I did eventually buy another one that had audio. This is the camera. Little bitty thing. I did eventually buy one that had audio. And so I could actually hear what people were saying. And then I could respond with the camera. I would shake it yes or shake it no. And I, they would ask questions and I could like hear them. So it was a lot of fun. Um, it was a lot of fun. And uh, that's one thing I, I really enjoyed is using this car. Um, and just drive it around. And, and drive up to people and just stop right in front of them. And just with the camera and just look at them, and they just like, are you serious? And you know they would they would speak and I could hear them and they'd ask questions and stuff. And then I was like, I would take off, it'd be gone, and uh, I would be sitting around the corner and uh, so I could hear them talking as well. And I just had a lot of fun with this one. So if you ever get bored, this is something that would be a fun project uh, to 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 have around now nowadays. You could probably just go buy one with a camera on it. That's boring. Make your own. Um, this is an old school RC-10T original. I, uh, I rebuilt this actually. Um, and, uh, this is a good car. This is a really good car. This was like one of the only RC things I ever had. And I didn't have this until I was almost in college. Um, so, yeah, anyway. And it was used when I bought it. I bought a whole tub of crap for like probably a hundred bucks or traded something. I don't remember. But, uh... Yeah, so anyway, that is when I was a kid, uh, number six. I uh, created a RC car with a camera on it and a portable. This was this was the impressive part, is that I had a portable control box with all my functionality, recharger in it, audio and everything. This knob is actually to tune in the, uh, the camera. And uh, see the white balance here is kind of whack. But it uh, has to do with this camera. This is the way it is. But yeah, anyway, that's, uh, there it is. There's number, number, uh, number six, when I was a kid. Now, this same camera is the camera that I used in my RC plane. Um, I'll show you that next. We'll do that next, maybe. I don't know if there's anything left of it. <laughs> anyway, there you go. Peace and love, RWG Research. My name's Russ. Have a good day. See you.